Here we have a 2020 BMW M340i xDrive. Now this vehicle comes with over £6,000 worth of optional extras, all of which are listed on the website. Just to mention one, we do have the technology package. Now we also have the 19 inch gloss black alloy wheels with the blue M Sport brake calipers. All of the alloy wheels are in excellent condition. We do also have the Dravit grey metallic paintwork, which has a really nice sparkle to it in the sunlight. We also have the LED headlights, gloss black front grills and gloss black front splitter. We also have the second alloy wheel just down here, again unmarked. We do have the side skirts along the bottom as well, colour coded door handles. We have the black door mirrors, black trim around the windows with the privacy glass as well for the rear passengers. Now we also have front and rear parking sensors with a rear reversing camera. We have the dual exit exhaust at the back, M340i badging as well on the right. If you press this button here on the remote, the boot will pop open just like so. And you'll find we'll be, we, we have plenty of space inside of here. We do have the extra storage pockets on the right and also on the left hand side inside of there. Handle underneath here so we can pull the boot back down. And back around to the driver's side, you can see the vehicle is free from any major marks, dents or scratches. If we take a look at the interior, inside of the back you can see we have the full leather seats, two-tone of the black and the red, we've got the M Sport style seat belts, foldable armrests in the centre and fixed ISO points as well back here. We also have the vents with the climate control in the centre. On the doors you'll find the brush battle door handles, electric windows and also the Harman Kardon sound system. If you have a look at the front, you'll also find the same leather seats, the two-tone black and red. There's a look at both of them. Both the front seats are heated as well. Again, the Harman Kardon sound system on the doors. We also have the electric mirrors and electric windows which are for the rear. Automatic lights down here. We also have the automatic wipers and a multifunctional steering wheel. Taking the seat inside, you'll find the digital dashboard in front of us. Put a foot on the brake, press the start button, the vehicle will start up for us. Got the cruise control speed to here on the left hand side. We do have the paddle shifters as well on either side. And you can see we are free from any warning lights on the digital dashboard. We also have the heads up display just up here. Now if that's flickering, or if any of these screens or lights are flickering, it's just the camera, they're not flickering in real life. Nothing to worry about. Got the main infotainment screen, which is currently showing the sat nav. We also have many more features with the buttons down here. Click on to media, you'll find the radio stations. We also have the other media options just here on the left. Bluetooth phone connectivity as well for phone calls. We also have a range of apps that are currently installed. If you go over to the left, you'll also find Apple CarPlay and Android Auto. Now going on to the main menu, if we go up to car, onto the settings, you'll find the interior ambient lighting. Plenty of colours which you can go through on here. We also have the intelligent safety system, making it a very safe vehicle to drive. Further down, you'll also find we have the jaws on climb control for the front passengers. Ice cold air conditioning with the heat seat buttons on either side. We also have some storage space inside of here, while it's phone charging, 12 volt connectivity, USB ports, and also the two cup holders. Automatic gearbox with the different drive modes. So just press onto these buttons, then you can quickly switch through the different drive modes, just like so. Also changes the look of the dashboard slightly for the different drive modes. Putting the car into reverse, you'll also find the reversing camera with the parking sensors on the right. Put it back into your park by pressing P. We then have the electric handbrake, auto hold button, and finally the armrest here in the center. But that's all I'm going to show you guys today. If you'd like to find out more, please check out the website. This vehicle comes with a fresh service, fresh MOT, and free nationwide delivery. Thank you for watching. Video test drive of this BMW M340i X Drive. Now, the purpose of the video test drive is to show the vehicle that drives as you expect it to. As you can see, I'm allowed to fire up the steering wheel to keep it in a straight line, not being off to the left or to the right hand side. Now, we're doing the multifunctional steering wheel, which has the paddle shifters on either side. So, if you want to steer the car into manual mode, you can simply tap on the paddles to change gear. We also have the cruise control and the speed meter buttons here on the left hand side, and we have the volume button and phone connectivity on the right. Digital dashboard in front of us, we can show different displays that you would have seen on the photos. Above there we also have the heads up display which is currently showing the speed limit for this current road along with the digital speedometer. Now if you do this in carefully throughout the video and test drive you'll also notice it will be free from any unwanted not 
locks or banks. We also have the premium Harman Kardon sound system, which really does sound incredible. We have the full leather seats throughout the vehicle, which are really comfortable, and you can easily do two, three, or even 400 miles in this vehicle and still get out feeling fresh. Both front seats are also heated, which is perfect for them on cold winter mornings. We also have many more features on the interior of the vehicle, we have the wireless phone charging, ambient lighting, we also have the intelligent safety system, making it a very safe vehicle to drive. We of course have the main screen here in the centre, packed full of features, which can be shown the sat nav, or as many more you would have seen on the photos. Now we've got our right indicator on, we're going to slow down, as we're going to take a right hand turn in a moment onto the industrial park, we just have to wait for the traffic to go past before we can make the right hand turn. We also have the automatic gearbox on this vehicle, which is really smooth for all the gears. We are about to take a right hand turn now, and we're going to be performing a military stop now in three, two, and one. Hold on to the brakes, pull the car into reverse, got the reversing camera, back into a drive with no issues whatsoever. Now, if this video has answered all your questions, then please feel free to get in contact with our sales team, where they can answer all and answer questions, along with what if some requires of you. That's all for me today though, cheers.